since December. We are a welcoming place for migrants who come into this community. Riverton Park United Methodist Church has welcomed migrants from the southern border. About 180 are here now. Mostly from Venezuela and Angola. Pastor Jan Bowlerjack says it was a treacherous trek for the migrants. A lot of trauma getting out of their countries. Uh, many of them saw relatives die, houses burn, soldiers pushing them along. Now they're facing another issue. We have been able to just do a few things uh, out of the goodness of our hearts, out of uh, random donations, but we're at the end of that and we need support from other agencies. On Friday, Tequila Mayor Alan Eckberg declared a state of emergency to address the growing number of asylum seekers needing help in the city. We've been calling for assistance for quite a while. Uh, the City of Tukwila wanted to wait until there were resources that were going to come available. They didn't want to just declare a state of emergency without something that was going to move forward. But how these people are going to get help is still being figured out. A City of Tukwila spokesperson tells King 5 there have been ongoing conversations between multiple levels of government and nonprofit organizations to provide resources. Resources that, for now, are being provided by Riverton Park United Methodist Church. My church is not out of resources because the community is very helpful. But that can only last for so long. Uh, are we stretched to the edge? Yes. Our utilities have gone from $1,000 a month to $10,000 a month. Cornelius Hawker, King 5 News.